Cusco, my lovely is lovely. So Empress here coming to do the fire signs, what you need to know, October 24th through the 30th, okay? We're going to take a look. Just to let you know, I have my last ritual up for the year. It's on my website. If you'd like to book, this is the time, okay? Uh, we're going to be tackling, clearing out the rest of the obstacles for the balance of the year and preparing for the new year. So if you're interested in that, it's November 8th. Go on my website and check that out. Spirit, can you show me what my Aries, Leo, and Sag need to know? You got mirror, okay? Um, mirroring each other, self-image, relationships, reflect on our wounds, introspection. So whatever is going on is making you look at some situation through a different lens. And this may be, you know, what you're seeing outside could also be happening within. Spirit, can you show me what else does the fire signs need to know? You have the runner and it's coming out crossed. Runner in a codependent relationship, fear of intimacy, listening to ego, okay? Sorry listening to ego so i feel like um <clears throat> there's someone avoiding some dealing with something and it, you could be doing it too but maybe in a different area maybe that this is showing you this with this person it's telling you that that's happening with you as well in some other area spirit is there anything else that my fire signs need to know from this deck okay so you guys could be taking turns with the runner chaser energy this could be a long-standing relationship last shuffle spirit okay and um this could be a problem in this connection okay it could be due to someone having an addiction okay codependent obsession possession controlling has a block restraint okay this person could be uh you know having some type of addiction okay this could have caused some type of codependent trauma bonding between yous okay and you know you could be having trouble moving past it okay i took out my deck that i had made about a year ago we're gonna see what else comes out for you guys spirit can you show me what else does my fire signs need to know please what else does fire need to know what else does fire need to know? You have here, fuck boy. Okay, so this could be somebody coming in and out of the relationship, male or female. Okay, energy vampire. Okay, uh, you know, they love you when they love you and when you're giving to them, but then they're off doing other things. This could be a sexual addiction too, okay? You also have this heifer here, okay? So they could be going back and forth between like a baby mama, baby daddy, and you, somebody that you're familiar with, okay? or maybe you don't know them in that way but you know of them or they know of you okay spirit can you show me what is the situation for my fire signs aries leo or sag please what is the situation you have the page of cups here spirit can you show me uh you know there could be an apology or a small cup of love but it's not enough right spirit can you show me what um what is coming in for my fire signs please what's coming in for fire Okay, you have the emperor coming out cross. Somebody's controlling here. I also feel like the emperor has no clothes, okay? Like this person wants to be something that they're not exhibiting, okay? Also, can you show me what is falling away for my fire signs, please? What's falling away, please? What's falling away for fire, please? You have here um, the Three of Cups with the Seven of Cups, so illusions in the situation. Spirit, can you show me what is it that my fire signs cannot see, please? What can't they see? Thank you. And you have the uh, Three of Wands and the Five of Swords. There's some type of manipulation happening here. Okay, can you show me what... Um, what is the truth of the matter for fire signs, please? What's the truth of the matter for my fire signs? You have the eight of pentacles, okay? Either you're working a lot or you're trying to work on something. Spirit, can you show me the most likely outcome, okay? Um, with the moon, but there's a lot of secrets and unknowns, okay? Queen of cups, okay? Your heart is definitely involved in this situation. Gonna get a deck to clarify these. You got the page of cups as the situation. Spirit, why is that? Why is this page of cups here for the situation for my fire signs with the two of cups, okay? So it's like a soulmate energy, okay? And, you know, 
there's a lot of apologies here with the Knight of Wands because they keep coming in and out of a situation with the Eight of Swords. It has you stuck in your head. Now, what's coming in is the Emperor Cross. Spirit, why is that? With the Four of Cups, it feels like you've tried to let this go emotionally, but you're having a hard time. And the Six of Pentacles, they don't give equally to you. This person is a little controlling, like I said. Okay, I feel like this control is not real. It's like... They want to act like the boss, but they, they're not the boss, okay? Or it's like they don't know how to be the emperor, but they feel like acting out in negative ways makes them the emperor. So maybe like having multiple partners or having their options open to them makes them feel more masculine, whether this is a male or female, okay? Now you have a three of cups here with the nine of pentacles. This person likes to be free, Okay, uh, you know, and I feel like this is a situation where this doesn't make you happy. With the Seven of Cups, I feel like they're not always honest. Spirit, why is the Seven of Cups here? Seven of Cups is coming out with the Page of Swords. So you could be trying to reach this person at times and you catch the machine. They could be really blocking your number. Uh, okay, and then, you know, they tell you some story why they couldn't contact you. You have the three of wands here in the position of what you can't see. And it feels like you want to plan a future. Three of wands coming out with the full cross. Okay, so it's like you can't start this new beginning with this situation. And there's some kind of naivete happening here with the five of swords and the nine of cups. Okay, it's like this person is manipulating you and saying all the right things because they know that's what you want. But they're not really intending to give you that. Okay, they could be saying that they're at work, okay? The Queen of Swords, I feel like you already know the truth about this situation, okay? With the Eight of Pentacles in the position of the truth of the matter, Spirit, why? It's coming out with the Three of Pentacles and the Star, okay? So this collaboration, all right, it's like they have a collaboration and you feel very drawn to them, but you need to be careful because this person, they don't have the same thing in mind as you do, okay? With the Two of Pentacles, their happy future consists of them juggling two situations and i don't feel like this person wants that to change you see the seven of swords just came out to this moon card okay it's like they're deceiving you and they know what you want so they're telling you what you want to hear okay and the king of pentacles could be an earth sign but i feel like you know maybe they have a good job or something like that so they feel like, you know, if they help you with some bills or whatever, that should be enough, okay? With the hermit, I feel like you're realizing that you spend a lot of your time alone, okay? Spirit, can you show me what else do my fire signs need to know about this situation? You got mature, man. This person could be older than you or you could feel like they need to mature. Spirit, what else? Okay, poverty is coming out crossed, okay? I feel like the help that they give you isn't even all that much. It's like the bare minimum, okay? It's not to help you level up in any way. It's kind of to keep you codependent, okay, with the co uh, courtship here, okay? And anything else from this deck? Last shuffle, spirit. Yeah. At the bottom of the deck is unexpected income, okay? Spirit, can you show me why is this mature man here for my fire signs why is this here please with purpose okay so i feel like this person needs to mature all right they haven't found their purpose they're kind of just you know going along with life as it comes all right and you know benefiting from whatever situation is at the time okay with this poverty you know and freedom spirits telling you you're gonna have to find a way you know to to break away from this situation there's really not anything that is going to come of this other than where it is now so unless you like where you are now with this person you know you're going to probably have to move on you have courtship here spirit why is this okay you have courage here okay there may be something that's gonna take, yeah, regret and um, envy, right? So you may feel like in some way, like, you know, 
scared to to leave this situation behind okay but with regret i feel like you know you're if you keep investing more time okay and you could be investing this time because you feel like if you if you give up now this other person wins but really what are they winning stupid people win stupid prizes you know what i'm saying like spirits telling you you know if you invest more into this it may not change in the way that you want it it feels like you would be stuck okay worth waiting for it feels like that's what you're trying to do okay feels like that's what you're trying to do pop if you can take out those bags that are downstairs that'd be great thank you anything else spirit Pay attention to the red flags is coming out crossed with past life relationship. So, you know, um, I feel like with this pay attention with the red flags, it's like you're ignoring the signs because you want something to work out with this person. Worth waiting for a spirit. And this past life relationship, this could be why you're so drawn to them because this could have been something that, you know, um, that lingered on from a past connection okay you got worth waiting for with new life okay and um sorry i'm having trouble picking them up divine timing is at work in your love life okay so with this new life i feel like you know you're on the precipice of giving birth to a whole new situation this could have even happened to you while you were pregnant but i feel like first you have to release something okay because this person you know energy vampire right it's like taking your frequency away you gotta pay attention to the red flags coming out cross spirit why is that release and let go and to change your heart you know it's okay to say that this no longer is working for you instead of holding on because you feel like you have to win that could be the wrong um angle okay with the past life relationship gate closed see this is what i'm saying it's like you could keep going forward in this direction but i feel like you will inevitably have to deal with this situation and i feel like while you're doing that you know there is an, a relationship somewhere that's waiting on you so it feels like you should clear this out okay i can't tell you what to do you have to make your own decisions but that's the energy i'm getting for you guys okay so that's what i have for you guys for the week of october 24th through the 30th um if i resonated with you please like and subscribe i'm wishing you all light and love and blessings on blessings namaste gang gang bye